getting food. I want to check in now with Ken Smith. He's in Sky Witness 8 near Owens and Las Vegas Boulevard North. We have some traffic enforcement there for pedestrians, right? That's right. We have a pedestrian safety enforcement event going on uh, provided by the North Las Vegas Police Department and a lot of customer service here down below us. This crosswalk right here seems to be the center of the sting operation. This is going to be once again along Owens, right between Las Vegas Boulevard and the 15th Freeway. This guy right here, he is the decoy. He is actually a police officer with the North Las Vegas Police Department. What he does, he actually just takes a nice little stroll right across Owens. If anybody doesn't yield to the pedestrian, then they have lots of police officers down here that actually pull people over. One one after another this afternoon has been pulled over. I want to show you just an example here. Here's some earlier video that I shot from Sky. What to say? Take a peek at this. Here he is walking across the street right there. And there's a car. He waves hi to the guy. Very friendly, that pedestrian. That's actually an officer. And then the officer actually then pulls over that vehicle right there and provides them with some friendly customer service, a traffic violation. So make sure to watch for pedestrians whenever you're near a crosswalk. Reporting live over North Las Vegas, I'm Ken Smith, Channel 8 Eyewitness News. All right, Ken, thank you very much. This is breaking news from Channel 8 Eyewitness News. An update now on the breaking news that we brought you just a few minutes ago. A bicyclist has been killed near Charleston and Shadow Lane. Let's get out to Ken Smith right now for the very latest. And we have a major stretch of Charleston Boulevard shut down as a result of this investigation out here by Metro. We're going to show you uh, this live picture from Skywood to say it and show you this whole stretch of roadway. You can see Charleston Boulevard only in one direction, eastbound, completely sealed off from Rancho on over to Shadow Lane. This is right next to UMC Medical Center, and this roadway is going to remain sealed off until further notice while Metro is currently in the middle of their investigation. We've learned so far that the truck was traveling northbound on Westwood here and stopped the stop sign in Charleston to make a right-hand turn to go eastbound on Charleston. Uh, the bicyclist was also traveling northbound, and as the truck was making a right-hand turn, the bicyclist uh, rode into the uh, front portion of the pickup truck. When the truck made the turn, the bicycle was knocked to the ground, and the truck ran the bicyclist over. And as a result of, uh, of that, you can see investigators have this roadway completely sealed off, causing uh, traffic chaos here this afternoon along Charleston Boulevard. Eastbound delays are backed up a good half mile approaching here, so your best bet is to use Sahara or Desert Inn as your eastbound alternate route this afternoon. Also, Rancho southbound is backed up pretty heavily. We haven't received word of exactly how long it's going to be before Charleston Boulevard is reopened, but once again, uh, traffic homicide investigators from Metro's traffic fatal team are continuing their investigation at this hour of this fatal accident. Unfortunately, this afternoon along Charleston Boulevard eastbound right here in front of University Medical Center. Reporting live right over UMC, I'm Ken Smith, Channel 8 Eyewitness News. All right, thanks, Ken. In uh, other news today, more than three